DJI has been the apple of the drone industry for quite a while now and today I'll be showing you its latest, greatest and newest drone which is the DJI Mini 4 Pro. Okay, so the biggest problem with drones today is that when you fly in public places, if you're having a really big drone like the DJI Air and Mavic series, then it'll attract a lot of attention and also you need a drone pilot's license to fly the bigger drones which are about 250 grams. So this drone, which is DJI's one of the smallest drones, solves this problem being under 250 grams keeping it in the micro drone category this is dji's first mini drone to have omnidirectional optical avoidance as you can see here the fisheye cameras and it has a 4k 60 camera which can shoot in hdr and d log m for people who like to do color grading also okay so this drone has a one over 1.3 inch CMOS sensor which is a pretty big sensor for such a small drone which gives it amazing night shooting capabilities and which is also very comparable to the DJI Mavic and Air series and if you're a normal person who doesn't know much about cameras you won't notice such a big difference and even for professionals it's very hard to notice a difference so this also has DJI's new O4 transmission which gives it a 20 km full HD range and it has a 500 meters peak altitude. Drone also has many smart features like master shots, quick shots, hyperlapse, slow-mo, panorama, 360 degree shots and many other smart features which help even beginners creating cinematic footage just like professionals. All these features you get in this small package being under 250 grams and giving you 34 minutes of flight time which is the max flight time with the standard battery and up to 45 minutes of flight time with the plus battery but that does set it slightly above 250 grams. So some of the features that sets this drone apart from all its competition is the amount of safety features this drone has. So it has such a long range first of all and it also has smart return to home and AR mapping so it displays lines like the route which the drone is going to take on its way back to the home point and it has many more smart features and all these features are so that you don't lose this expensive piece of tech and so that you don't have a fly away with this drone and you don't lose it easily now let's summarize all of this now let's see some pros of this drone so there are many and varied so first of all overall build quality and flight quality so if you have ever flown or seen a dji drone flying you know how well they fly and this also flies like a dream and then there's the incredible battery life which this drone gives incredible image quality of the drone but like everything this also has some cons. So the first con is that it's a really light drone. So you can't expect it to have really high speeds like the bigger drones. And therefore it has slightly reduced wind resistance. So if you're flying at like about 38 kilometers per hour wind speeds, it won't handle so well. And there is a chance of it getting lost and flying away. And another top disadvantage is that these propellers are screwed on to the motors of the drone. So you will have to carry your screwdriver along to replace the propellers if they ever get damaged. Even the speed of the drone is slightly less than other drones. The top speed in sports mode is only 60 km per hour and the pitch angle of the drone is also less. Well, so should you buy it? Well, definitely yes, if you know what you're going to do with it, because this is a professional drone and it's worth the money if you're going to use it well. 
I've flown many drones till now, like expensive pirate drones and even cheap Amazon drones, which are not so good. And I can say that by far, this DJI Mini 4 Pro is the best, but also the most expensive. And that's the final word. And if you want to see the unboxing of this drone right here, then click on the video over here. And if you want to see some nice cinematic footage, just check my channel. Thanks for watching.